So today after class, somebody asked me in the Google form, how, what do I use to make the mouth move? Just like in the video of the Duolingo. I actually use PowerPoint and uh, I try to find a tutorial like quickly, but the only tutorial I found about Albert Einstein, the, it's the person who is sharing, like sharing extra steps. I, I did it like in a simple way. So I'm gonna show you right now. So this is me, my kindergarten graduation. Uh, you can see that I already prepared the cutout of my mouth from a duplicate photo. If you click twice or click crop, you can see the original photo that I cropped out. And I created the same shape uh, for the background of the mouth to give the illusion of the puppet. I use the arrow keys to give me like more fine tuning. And then I select the piece I want to animate. Go to animations. Click here so that you can see all of them. And you choose custom, custom path. Then the cursor changes to a uh, this cross. You'll be able to click, and then like lines will come and click. So I click down. Then I'm gonna click up. So the the mouth is gonna move down. Then it's gonna go up. And you can continue as many times as you want. So this this time I kind of clicked around, uh, in a wrong way. So let's see. The other thing I want to do is to make sure that the size of the mouth matches. So down, up. Down, up, down. Anyways, that's how I did it, I guess. I don't remember. It's been like almost like, over seven years, I guess. Uh, but then you can always like change. I can make like go to another place. I can really, I don't know if you remember that cartoon South Park. They used to use this, I guess. Because it's this effect isn't supposed to be beautiful or whatever. It's just to make a uh, funny thing like. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that uh, there may be apps out there uh, that is for free, but like we have to search. So if you, any of you find the app or an app that is for free, doesn't want to be asking for money all the time, uh, please share with us so others can also have this tool in their pocket for their use. Thank you.